My History Project is about George Murdoch, my great-great-grandfather. Unfortunately, we don't know a lot about him. George Murdoch, my great-great-grandfather. He was born in a mining community in the east of Scotland, in a little town called Loch Gelly. This was a mining um, area, and he himself did become a miner. So we weren't, we're not quite sure why he would join the um, Royal Scottish Fusiliers uh, because he didn't have to, he was in an essential employment. He served in the war, the First World War, and this is a death penny and it's because he died. Every family who, one of the people who were in the war died, they get a death penny and it's, it looks like this and it says his name on it there. Possibly he wanted to serve his country and um, he was sent off to war in the north of France and unfortunately that was where he probably very early in he lost his life. I was given this, um, the plaque, when after my mother died yeah. and I've kept, kept that. It was called the Death Penny. That's its kind of popular name. Yeah. Um, and it was awarded to all of those who died in the First World War. And it says, he died for freedom and honour. This is him before he went out to war. Um, and in his, in his uniform. He married a woman quite early who had already had a child. And then they had two children called Catherine Murdoch and John Murdoch. He had married my grandmother, Catherine M Murphy, and she became Catherine Murdoch. She, they had had two, the two children, that, as um, Katya said, Catherine, who was the oldest, and who was my mother, and John, who became my uncle. But somewhere along the line, my grandmother, after um, George's death, moved to the west coast of Scotland, again to a mining um, area, and there she actually married um, another, had another husband uh, who they had children. But I can't remember a great deal of um, the history of my great-grandfather because it wasn't spoken of a great deal, mm. possibly because um, she had married again and had a new family.